Sail drones are just one element in an arsenal of high-tech vehicles monitoring climate change that scientists want to increase in the Southern Ocean. So let's really see what how, what the role of the Southern Ocean is in absorbing, acting as a sponge and sucking all this carbon out of our atmosphere and keeping the whole world, you know, cooler. Observations during Southern Ocean winters have been impossible in the past, too dangerous for humans. These drones can go down where scientists can't. You could sail it all the way out to the Southern Ocean. It could sail thousands of kilometres there, do the science that you need and sail back to the, to the pier. It's pretty amazing. A group of international scientists meeting in Hobart this month called for a boost to ocean monitoring. So we need urgent action in science, but also in communication of science to policy to get the decision makers to understand what's happening, what may happen in the future, and how we can best manage those changes. These subs are another tech tool. They'll be sent under a melting ice sheet. What is really special about the Autosab is that we can send it to places where ships and other technology cannot go in. The Southern Ocean absorbs human-created carbon and heat, but just how much and for how long it can keep doing it remains uncertain. There's evidence it's at a tipping point, making it vital that scientific observations are ramped up. The problems have been caused by us, but the solutions can also be driven by us if we make the right decisions at the right time. And that time is now. Fiona Breen, ABC News.